And alright, that's us going out live for some Resident Evil 7 beginning hour teaser demo, Midnight Edition. So <laughs> we're playing in VR, which I didn't realise you could do for the, the demo. I thought it was just being uh, reserved for the main game. Let me just uh, maybe start the VR mode tutorial. You can change advanced settings and play the VR mode tutorial later from the options menu, but we recommend you complete the tutorial if this is your first time using VR mode. All right, let's go for that. Oh my goodness. Get yourself in a comfortable position and then press options. Oh. Holding options will register your current position. If you significantly change your posture and feel that the tracking is off, hold options to re-register. There are red markings on the top, bottom, right and left sides of this room. Turn your head and focus on them one by one for two seconds each. If you have a hard time turning your head to look at them, try repositioning your body. Use L on the wireless controller to move, pushing L up. Move you in the direction you're looking, try walking to the goal area in front of you now. Moving while objects or walls are within close sight may cause discomfort. The white lines around you will give you a better understanding of distance, distances in the virtual world around you. They can be turned on or off in the options menu. Use the right analog stick to turn in 30 degree intervals. Try doing this a few times now. You can turn by moving your head, but when you can't turn as much as you'd like, use right analog stick instead. Try moving to the three goal areas around you. Pushing right analog stick up will set your head's current facing direction as the default forward facing position. There are many VR mode related settings available in the options menu. Once you've got used to VR mode, try adjusting these settings to optimise your experience, but be aware that certain settings may result in discomfort for some. I, I, can, I can imagine that. This is the end of the VR mode tutorial. When using VR mode, we recommend that you take breaks at regular intervals. If you begin to feel uncomfortable or tired, stop using VR mode immediately. Is that just the wooden? I don't know if I could play all Resi 7 like this. There was nothing even in that room and I was freaking out. <laughs> Is it loading or am I supposed to be? Oh god. Scared of menus. Uh, right. So I guess I've done the... Let me just readjust that. There we go. Um, right, so this stuff. VR mode. What have we got here? Field of view. Hmm. Is orientation mode. Now 
Right, let's get into it. Oft. Right. Get out of the house. So dashed them against the stones. Oh no. Don't know if I deal with it. No, there's no way I could play Resi 7 like this. Horrifying. Utterly horrifying. Oh god. There's my in hand. Oh. No. I've been in here before. Been in this place a lot. Tommy fingers in there. That's kitchen. Before the table got flipped there. Oh, I, I can't do this. Can we do this? this happening but it's so different in VR. <sighs> it was scary enough actually playing it. And standard. Of course. Disgusting. It's terrifying. Like, utterly terrifying. I can't eat. Any stress. How unbelievably uncomfortable I am. Not because of like, I'm not getting too bad nausea, you've got quite a slow walking. This, this door. I don't remember this, oh god. I, I can't do this. See, even if like a nice a nice puppy came running around the corner, I'd scream and die. <laughs> it's too horrifying. I don't think I can do this. <laughs> and that door is this where we came through. We've got the video. We know what happened in the video. Why is it so horrifying? Like everything. It's because I'm in here. I'm actually in this place and it's... It's horrifying.
Boo. Where did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. <sighs> this new guy? I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. New plan. We do a walkthrough of the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gators, another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. Should we tell him that the kitchen happens in here and what the hell was that? Is he scared of moth's shadows? I know everything that's going to happen here as well, but... Are we rolling? All right, let's go. <clears throat> but, Get guys, we don't want to go in here, guys. Honestly, I know I'm oh, for the future. <sighs> After you. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sound. Ooh, is it haunted? Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know? Weekend sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. <sighs> I... What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long did you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. This will make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit. I know I shouldn't have worn my good shoes. Oh, shit. Glad I had my shot. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? 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 Clancy, you see where Andre went? No, but I know where they went. Where but... is he? Unfucking believable. <laughs> this is the last time I worked with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. Listen, I've been here before, but it was, I mean, it was still scary, but I didn't feel like I was actually there. What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Listen, I'm for the future. I know what happens. Andre! Where the fuck is he? Look, he's done a, a sort of a well, and he's no, he's no well. So we should just go. Andre, where are you, man? Go. I mean, fuck this show. I, I agree. I agree. But before we find Andre, let's just go. Because he's not in here. Oh, crouching is odd. Stand back up again. I couldn't play. It's too, it's too real. I couldn't play Resi 7 like this, I don't think. You first. No. Need a nice hero shot of me. Coming down the ladder. Oh, I can't know what so, happens. So, uh, you first. No, I refuse. I don't even want to see him. You don't even want to see what happens when I go down there. I don't want to go down there. 
You go down there. I'm going him. <laughs> Man. Oh, I'm going down there. Oh my god. Oh my god. There is no way I could play this. Listen, man. <sighs> I don't even want to see him. He'll be right in front of me. He's not going to be happy when I turn him round. Ask him what he's doing down here. <sighs> God damn it, Andre. Why? Why did he come down here? It's horrifying. I don't even want to see you. Mate, you good? I'm going to shut my eyes actually because I don't want to see you. Oh my god. I know, I know you will. You will. Right. So the axe will be there now. I'm just terrified of everything. Terrified at everything. Feel like I should have the axe though. Don't you welcome me to the family, honestly. I'll have a heart attack. Don't you want to be welcome to the family? Just Danny Danny do that. Danny find the hang either. Go that way, it's welcome to the family, son. So be brave. If you've got an axe, how do you use it after? <coughs> right, you need the fuse. Where was the fuse? I can't even remember. Could we smash a thing like that apart with this axe? This is on you. Of course, of course, the bathtub full of blood and a bicycle, obviously. Toilet's a mess. My heart. I can't do it. Great. Did I get a handgun? Utterly horrifying. Obviously, a bank notebook. <sighs> I can't even, honestly. Sorry for the disjointed uh, ramblings, but. I can't 
ideal. Can he? I mean, I don't even know if I want to get in there. Can we not just get welcome to the family and then I can... It's the fuses up the stair, isn't it? It's been a while since I've played this. There isn't there, is it? What happens if I jumped in there? Death? Far too scared, like. Oh! Oh, my heart, that's it. No, I'm done. Finished. Finished now. Been through the mouldy door and seen a new area. I'm happy with that. Happy with that. Oh no, man. Horrifying. I can't even remember where I got the fuse. Can't do this. <laughs> I can't. It's too. It's too horrifying. They've reached a level where it's actually doing me damage to get a fright. I can't be shouting like that at this time of night either. Jeez. No, I can't. I can't. <laughs> Let me check, son. I need just get to like a menu that doesn't he film maybe terror. <laughs> well, I'd say there's a lot of chat. Cheers for tuning in, Fault and Sparky. Did they just bring the game out? Stop updating the demo. John, John. It is, it is scary, Falter. It'd be a better game without the VR, I think. Oh, can you see the, the white grid? I'll maybe get rid of that. Get in there. Aye, <laughs> 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 man, I'm in the Matrix again. Yeah, yeah, January 24th, I think. 
Ah, uh, they keep updating the demo. Yeah. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Turn you into flat. Aye. Aye, it's horrifying, man. It's horrifying. Honestly. I can't... Uh, I know, I quit, right? I'm going to go back in. I'm going to go back in, right? It's... Honest to God, it's horrifying. Wait, I can't... Uh, I can't uh, deal... I can't uh, deal with the... Uh, like, uh, I wish, I wish you knew what it was like. Cause basically, it's full 3D and I'm in there. I'm going to go back in. I don't know, I, where's the, f I can't remember where the fuse is to make the guy's door happen. And it's too scary, man. It's like kitchen, except for I can move around, and kitchen was only a like a three minute long thing. <sighs> I said I was gonna be brave, but I don't think I can. I mean, that's a noise of of fear that I just made there, where I was trying to breathe in and breathe out and calm myself down all at the same time while talking to you. <sighs> it's so horrifying. I'll get rid of that grid. It's actually that grid feels like somehow I'm safe in the grid. But it's not let's get rid of it, buddies. How do you do that? How do you get rid of the grid again? Display VR mods. Uh... <laughs> right, let's try that. It's going to be even scarier. I'm not going to have... No, it's still there. There's a reticle. HUD? I'm not sure guys. Only display when aiming. What is that thing called again? They told me about it. Sure they called it a grid. This is me like, hopefully gonna spend enough time in this so that you will he's all grow bored and go away and I can like, sneak away quit and never upload this video of me being a total wimp. <laughs> uh, right. I don't know what that's called. Orientation guide. I think that's what it was called. Ah, it was. And my God, it's horrifying. <sighs> right. Um. Always, always this way. I turned, I turned back round because there's seemingly nothing we can do in this area till we do something with the, the toilet. The hell was that noise? It's too scary. No, 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 no. I can't even play the piano, man. He'll come and get me. You know what, that's exactly what I would do. I would play the piano until they came to me. I wouldn't be cutting about looking for them. Although they would do me in once they found me. There's a fuse now on top of this table. Was it on top of the table on the other? Just jabbering, just jabbering. I really don't remember where the fuse is. I know the fuses are on the wall, but I know I can pick one up. I know. That's what I've been talking about the whole time. 
he's kind of welcome me to the family because I'm not doing anything. He's kind of like, right, he's no, he's not solving it. He's an idiot. Just kill him. Robinson's kind of got me used to this style of playing. Oh man, if I could only remember where the fuse was. Of course I wanted to look at that, I wanted to look at this manky scissors. Things in the real world there are making noise, it's, my, it's the VR cable. Smashing off the computer chair. Was it, was it like in a drawer or something? I feel like it was harder to get than just being in a drawer. You're welcome me to the family, that's what happens in there. If you try to use the key, it tells you it says welcome to the family, son. Only if I try to use the key though, isn't it? Sorry that I'm not really making much progress here, but I'm trying to get used to being in this sort of. I'm probably gonna. I'm. I'm gonna repeat myself, but I mean, I've said this a lot, but I really didn't get like what VR would be like through watching videos of people in it. I genuinely thought they were just like overreacting and like playing up for effect, but honestly, <laughs> you just need to have a shot of this. You need to have a wee shot of VR if you know somebody that's got it. Because there isn't anyone else like it. I mean, I thought the, the most amazing thing I'd ever seen really was was like Res being played in a cinema and Child Eden in 3D games wise until I played VR. <sighs> I can't remember where the fuse is, I'm sorry everybody, I've made a total mess yet. That doesn't work until you get the fuse, but do I need to push that? done the demo. I remember getting the fuse. Do you remember? Do you remember how to get the fuse? I'm going to talk to you because I'm lost as hell. Let's see what you have been saying. Hopefully seven will be the best. Ah, uh, it's pretty good, like. You want to hear again? <laughs> get murdered. <laughs> what, you're a girly scream? No, near the beginning there was a there was a sort of wail of terror. Aye, quiet bits were even scary, exactly. That's what this is like, wandering about somebody else's house. Knowing that if you go to the door you're going to get caught, so you try to find the fuse. I can't remember where, uh, where the fuse is, guys, I'm sorry. I really didn't remember. I've got this axe. feel like... Um, What's his name again? Baker. Baker, the arms tech president. No, no, it's no, it's... It is Baker, isn't it? I've, had, I've just overwritten it with Metal Gear information again. Nothing happened in the mouldy house. Then that, that bit was just a bike in a bathtub. And there's nothing else in there. Is there? Doubting myself. I don't know why you go through the mouldy door again, because it's still, to a certain extent, 
unknown territory. <laughs> I feel like it must be something to do with this. Did, oh, did I just move them? No, but can I... No, I don't. You need to just put in the one that's missing. The one for the stairs. It's too scary, like right? hearing other people's footsteps that are near on. Why is that door staying wide open? Did he just wander by again? Sick. Look at these. It's like you used to be a nice family, that's horrifying. Don't come and get me because I'm looking at your photo. And I mean, you, you might still be a nice family. I know I said that you used to be a nice family. He's, he's still... Huh? Everything's like 100% more real seeming. Honestly, the demo was scary enough the first time. I can't even... I shouldn't have looked in the options. I should have just played it normal. It's far too intense. I've been working all day, man. I'm susceptible. Vulnerable. I'm a vulnerable person, then. I? Seriously, where's the fuses at? Baker, where's your fuse for the stairs? Gonna come out and weather me for that bit of cheek there, right? Like. Where was the fuse box? I, I remembered about the axe. I remembered to pack the lock to get the axe, but was there something else I was supposed to do to get the fuse? Because I definitely did get the fuse before. Honestly. My heart. <coughs> Got the dummy finger. I can't remember how to get the fuse, guys. I think I was supposed to get it in the video in the past. The fuse isn't in the pot, you know. It's just manky stuff that's in there. Mmm, the coat in hand. Yeah. A cockroach on it. Get that out of me. Right, there's nothing. Sniff fuse in there. <sighs> it's been too long since I've played it and I kind of remember. I feel like I've looked. In most of the places. It's only a matter of time before the guy comes and tears me to shreds. They wouldn't have moved, did they, would they have moved the. No, the other stuff was in the same place. Was it in the past I was supposed to do that with the fuse box? Shower on just to make me feel. No, I can't do this. I'm lost. There's no water in the toilet. The dummy finger.
Adventures. It's too much. I'm too scared to ever and to get in and done. See, scared of the door that opened there went on. Why don't you just get the Google out and tell us where the fuse is, please? He's <laughs> <laughs> having the all left. Oh. If that was the game, I would have punished them for one <laughs> Oh, what? Looks like fried fish brain. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm, I'm used to getting the finger. Get the microwave on. Get the nap. <laughs> I do like the founder. Fishing for compliments. No. Just ain't sure about first person view. Aye. I agree with that, like. And he's nowhere to find the fuse, boys. He's. <laughs> Get on the Google, right? See if you can find where the fuse is. I'll find her a bit more. Find her in the dark. That is walk time. That is. Is it in the past? Is that what I've done wrong? I feel like I've looked everywhere in the present. Been in here. In the guy's bathroom, we always. Used syringes and booze and angels everywhere. And that, I've seen that, I've definitely seen that. Why the bike? That's the bit I'm trying to. Why any of it? Almost relaxed enough that if something happened, I would be very much not well. <laughs> I really can't remember how to get the fuse though, and I can only apologise. See if I played the videotape again, would that let me double check if I'd messed up with the fuse? Let's, let's do that. Maybe the guy will be like, I don't want to watch it again, I'll be like, we're watching that again, mate. <laughs> so I've got to be sure, but I'm going to check the comments really quick. See if he's only just hurling a bunch of uh, well-deserved abuse, aren't we? <laughs> it's in your pocket, John. No, it's not. <laughs> Pull the weaver in the fireplace, ain't it? Through the hatch, though, Holmes. That's, I've been through there. Through the hatch is the cellar part. Get down there, mate. <laughs> It was neat, alright, I'm going down the cellar, but see if it doesn't work. See if I fought in my death and get bad nausea because you were sort of, like giving me the bad advice to like fling myself down into that cellar. It's gonna be like Evil Dead 2 down there. No, there's no way, look, there's no ladder. We're climbing for ages. No, it doesn't let me. It doesn't let me fling myself. <laughs> Down there to try and do myself in. <coughs> Guys, I don't know where the uh, where the fuse is. 
for the guy's fuse box. Is the fuse then where the axe? No. Aye, is it? The fuse then where the axe used to be. Eh, uh, where the lockpick used to be. does a scary hang like field of view wise where it gets obviously I don't know if you'll be able to see that but it gets why are you grasping the axe like that what's happening we're under attack right there's nothing down the side of there and there's just a crow in there isn't it some sort of microwaved crow ice cream for crow Got to be playing the videotape then. This has got a weird sort of jovial swing to it. Just when you're walking about. Get that video in there again. Should I look to the comments? Let me quickly look at the comments while that bit's happening, right? Because <laughs> you know what's what's going to be happening. It's going to be the two guys. Don't think you can get fuse if you play video first. Damn it! Damn it! I thought it might be something like that. Who's the fruit in the cell? Who is in my fruit cell? <laughs> ah, exactly. Evil Dead too. Hi, I've made a mess of it, haven't I? Well, I just go get welcome to the family. Can I skip this? Ooh. God damn it, that's scarier. Find this guy. Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Listen, I don't know, uh, guys. I don't want to do this again. I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. Ah, that did not make me feel good. We do a walkthrough of the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Just like we always do. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? No problem. Tonight on Sewer Gator, another worthless fucking shithole. Happy? Ecstatic. Right, Andre, I mean, come on. Guys, made the mess. Are we rolling? All right, let's go. <clears throat> Get out of the way. <clears throat> it's loud. <clears throat> After you. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? Fuck me. How was it anchor, you know? We can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. You can hide the subtitles in Andre. Andre. What's the story, Andre. Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. How long did you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit! No, I shouldn't have worn my good shoes. 
Oh, shit. Glad I had my shots. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? I don't know what to go through there, Lena. Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Oh, man. So we did in the, uh, sailor. Where is he? Unfucking believable. I know, man. This is the last time I work with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy? You stick with me. No, actually, the hell we going up there, don't know. <laughs> it's a lot darker, eh? It's so what weird though. He's like right there. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright, new deal. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. Do you go down there? He's down there, wait, I can see him. You go down. That's me why you go down. You first. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. So, uh, you first. No. You first. I'm away. Go down here and I'll get welcomed to the family. And then I'll try and figure out what to do to get the fuse first. What do you do see? That. What is it? Oh, it's Andre, man. He's like, it's, it's no well. Oh, he's really no well. Fine. Right, well, welcome to the family it is. <sighs> I think I'll be less scared of him. No, because it's jarring, like. It'll feel like he's broke my neck when he turns me in. It's his kitchen, I've been sat right there. Just <sighs> I know. Welcome to the family, son. Tiny Wayne, welcome to the family, man. <laughs> welcome to the family, son. Ah, there we go. I've not been punched in the face in VR before, so that was good. Aye, welcome to the family. Bad ending. Thanks for that. Thanks for the bad ending. <laughs> Resident Evil Ambassador Program. I think I signed up for that. 
an imported Resi remaster from Japan. But that was it, that was it in VR. Oh yeah. It was really odd. <laughs> Welcome to the family. <laughs> ah, yeah, it is too scary, JX. Cheers for tuning in, though. <laughs> no way would I play this in VR mode. Ah, it's, it's hard, like, I've got to restart it, damn it. If you get the axe now, then you must use it for something to do, rather than get the fuse. So I think you get to play it right. Right, so I need to get the fuse before I play the video. <laughs> Cheers for all the chat, thanks for tuning in everybody. It is scary. It's funny that <laughs> Paul was saying it. <laughs> It's not a good answer to that question. <laughs> Listen, it's mad scary. It's scary as hell. Aye, there is jump scares. <laughs> right, welcome to the family. My God. <sighs> right, I might uh, I might stop the broadcast here and uh, try again. <sighs> Don't know if I can do it tonight. I might be doing a bit not in VR mode for for context, but that is that is heavy. That is pretty heavy going. <laughs> Bye. Cheers for tuning in, everybody. And I hope we see you again very, very soon. Get it on the net. <laughs> right, I'll, st I'll stop and I'll jump back out just for a second. <laughs> Bye.